Hi and welcome. This is my Arch Merch ISO Builder SSD. I want to tell you about a possibility in Arch Linux, so also in Arch Merch, to downgrade systems. It's already on your system. It's called Downgrade. So it's an application and you should tell them what to downgrade. I don't think there's a lot of information in the man. Let's have a look. So not really, but you can use some Pac-Man options, he says, never use that. But let's give it just a try. At this point in time, we're um, beginning February, we have PAMAC having uh, some strange issues. Some machines have it, some don't. And those are the things you might happen, I, or that might happen with other applications. So it's just about what to do. If you want to downgrade something comes in and say hey this update i don't like it i want the older one an older version so we have now pamac aor 6.3.1 that's the new version and if we open it package manager oh is it already open my mistake of course then we go to about and it says 6.2.2 2. all right so i'm using an older version and the older version works so i already downgraded and i'm gonna do it all over again just to show you guys what to do how to do it so in preferences that's the issue today at hand we can just say let's have the preferences and let's change it so this pop-up window does not show up anymore in the new version so that's a puzzle and we really don't know at this point in time what's the issue but if you want to in general downgrade an application that's not working as supposed to and, and, and how you want it or you just don't want the update like a new firefox coming in or anything uh, then you say let's downgrade this thing so you just say okay you apply and you're going to install it and afterwards after installation you say hey uh, this is not what i want so let's completely build it you can always press uh, here details and done so it's already built not sure if it's going to show, but I'm going to quit anyway, because I want to show you also Super Shift D, that's what I do, to PAMAC dash tray. Hold on. I have to type it correctly, of course. Uh, PAMAC tray. So here it is, PAMAC tray. If we launch this one, is this little icon coming back up? And then we go to package manager, and then of course you see, hey, it has been updated. So 6.2.3 so that's the issue 6.2.2 goes to 6.2.3 fine everything looks fine but then you go into preferences and you type in your password and then it says this keeps rolling and it's doing something and it can't be it can't edit it now if you still want to keep this which is also possible just keep it file system go to etc and we have here also a PAMAC. Uh, so, PAMAC. So here's a PAMAC.conf. You can set everything that's got the pop up that's coming is actually telling enable AOR, check AOR updates, and all that. So you can just copy paste these things and have the same settings I had just earlier on. But the tutorial is about getting back to the older version. So we're going to stop this thing. And we have here downgrade. Only thing you need to know, and Control Shift D is very good at that. A Mac. Uh, so no, it's not good. I'm afraid it doesn't say the application. It doesn't show it. It's not called Pamac Installer. It's called Pamac Hour. So the best thing maybe to do is is check this out, and then you see that that's the name. That's the actual name we should use. Okay, C. Control C, of course. Downgrade. Type it. And this has to be typed all the way. So you have to really know the name. And then it says, okay, understand. You want to downgrade. Fine. And then it finds the older version. And that's maybe also interesting to show you guys. In the file system, there is a var cache pacman package. That's the one. So this folder holds all your packages 
and all the older packages. So Amec is holding here 6.2.2. So you have the older version here. You just can double click the older version here. Oops, I've done that already now. So that's that's easy. You can do that that way. But uh, there's of course this program, this application that says, okay, do it. Proceed with installation. And that line, that's why I have this tutorial here as well. That line is important. Let's open another file, which is etc pacman dot conf. Waited too long. I waited too long. In here somewhere is pacman, this pacman.conf. Lots of things open. Let's zoom in. And <coughs> where will it go? It will go here. So ignore package. I have already one package in there, it seems. But ignore package. And um, what was I going to do? This thing here. So add PAMAC AOR to ignore package. Ignore package, line 25. And then you say, okay, that's a good idea. Otherwise, it will always show, hey, you have an update, you have an update. It's going to be red, the icon. So, yes, add it to this line. And what happened in the back? He added PAMAC AUR to the pacman.com. So, that's, this is quite an important step. And you've learned a lot of things already. And, well, done. It's a done deal. And it's safe now everywhere your system knows you should not update it here, it should not be read at all. So your system is up to date, he says, because you just loaded up pacman.conf and he says, I have to ignore that one. And it says just a white thing here. So if you open it again, let's see if we have now the older version already, or should we reboot? Reboot in the sense of restart. But no, 6.2.2 is already available. And is the pop-up working or not? That's the question. That's the issue at hand. That's the trouble we have, but well, probably I'll need to, to stop this thing and then quit it and try it again. Control Shift D, Panic Tray, Enter. So now a new application started. I'm going to do it all over again and see if the pop up works. And there we are. So if anybody has a solution for this time, which, uh, this is the time of the year, 3rd February, we are a bit puzzled as to why the new version is working on some of our computers and not on all of our computers. But downgrading is a possibility for now, um, but it is strange. All right. Cheers.